All right, I'm just gonna uh, go through real quick. I got a Massey Ferguson 128 hay baler. I'm not sure of the year or anything like that. Um, but I've sheared a pin and I blew out a hydraulic hose in my tractor and it's been an interesting first year here. So I figured I'd do a quick video here on how I like to run my string on it. I've never done this before. This baler is new to me. Um, and since you got the strings coming out here, this has some guide holes or loop holes here that are going to come through. I want to keep them all separate. So now they come through and out here under this little tensioner here. It just has a spring on it to kind of keep that tight. And it goes through here. And then down here, we've got two different guides. So you got one for a string here and another one up above. And you always want to make sure you're keeping those strings separate. I found that out. So now you want to come get a better angle here. So now you got more guides down here underneath. So you keep one twine running through here. And there's a second guide. So both of the strings will come through the first one. One string goes up here, which is the closer of the two. Furthest one here. So I got another guide all the way over. And as you come through, you can see right here, you got a little eyelet where it comes through. So I just take the twine, run it down through there, and then I just tie it up here on this base. So then that way as the string pulls back through, it'll just go through the cutter, it'll cut it. That'll bring it right up top and run it through the bales. 